Okay, so what what Zisto? What mm -hmm. what do? Why so, are you a map maker now? Um, I think you remember. I I someone on my yeah okay. Let me tell you this yeah. first. Someone on my Facebook page posted a link of a video with you and Cleo and I think Milby uh, playing um, that Skyblock game. Yeah. And you were talking about how I would never exact revenge on you because I was too busy with a mega project this or mega project that. Yeah. What if my revenge on you was the mega project? Oh. That makes sense. <laughs> <sighs> so we've actually been talking about for a while, like as a joke video, having a room where I would just blow you up endlessly and just mm -hmm. to make a joke revenge video. So there was an idea I had for that that evolved into this, which is much more elaborate now. Th this is fair, right? Uh, yeah. So... This is a one versus one map. We're going to go through, and I'm going to try to kill you, but then we're going to reverse, uh, and you're going to try to kill me. Okay, kill the runner, huh? Mm-hmm. Yep. What do the... I, I have to ask, what do the C and R stand for? Okay, the R is the runner. You go through that okay, tunnel. makes sense. The C is the controller. He he operates up above. He, he, he can shoot at you, and he can use different mechanisms. Number one? Well, you know... Instead of retconning a numbering Fun. system later, I figured I'd just give it a number one. Yeah. Yeah, that's why, that's why, yeah, I had to do that too. Yeah. Kill the runner. The runner progresses through the map while the controller does their best to stop them. So it's counteroperative mm -hmm. from, I think I've talked about this before, it's counteroperative where one person triggers traps and stuff to try and kill the other player. Yeah. Oh, this looks like fun. Yep. Um, so there's a lot of text down here on the on the rules wall, but it's it's fairly straightforward. I just didn't want there to be any sort of uh, ambiguousness. On... Yeah, you have to explain every single thing, otherwise people are like, "Can we yeah. do this or can so we do that?" And you then, need and... uh, normal or hard because yeah. monster spawning is essential. Um, don't enter the tunnel with items. Um, don't try to. Like, if you're the runner, don't try to come up to where the controller is. You have to leave the chamber by the runner's en entrance and exit. Um, the You can try to kill the controller, but it doesn't count, because otherwise it might just devolve into a stalemate, where you never actually leave the... Uh, like, if you're down on a kill and you absolutely have to kill the controller to get a point, it... Um, so I decided not to count deaths against the controller. Uh-huh. And uh, maximum deaths of 10 per chamber for a similar reason, just so stalemates don't occur. Okay, that makes Does sense. It, everything makes sense? Yep. All right, so you go down the uh, the blue arrows, and I'll go up here. I guess the... I'm the runner first, huh? Yes. Well, it'll help because um, I know what all the mechanisms do. I think if two people okay. were playing this map from scratch... Um, I think the person that runs it f is the controller first might have an advantage. So you might want to look at everything beforehand if, if, uh, but for this, I'm just going to kill you a bunch of times. We... Okay. You, I guess you deserve it just cause seven months, <laughs> man, damn. Well, and I'll, I'll um... explain what everything is. I'm not going to send you in blind as the uh, runner. Ooh, what's this stuff? You can't have any Ooh. of that here. Oh, go, oh wow. Go to your tunnel. What, look, look at all this. Oh, can I have a sword? No. Oh, Not, actually, you get a better oh. sword in your chunk. What's that do? That's, you get... It's a stick, isn't it? Hmm? No, no, no. You get a real sword. It, okay. You can't actually Not hit me because we're not... Uh, and I, I put these uh, this glass in between the tunnels so you can see where the other mm -hmm. player is. Okay. Um, oh, can we turn... Do you have a server command to turn the rain off? Um... I don't. I put glass on top of, of uh, all the chambers. Okay. Well, hopefully I once we get inside, it won't. Hopefully you won't be able to hear it. Okay. Because I didn't want the rain to drown out your audio. Oh. Yeah. Is it that loud? Player two follows blue arrows. I'm player two, huh? Mm-hmm. So are these? Uh, 
are there two two instances of this yes that we do yeah there's a there's are they a, identical yes so you're gonna play the the exact same thing a little bit later uh-huh so it's probably okay. better that I'm the controller first so you get a feel for what all the mechanisms are gonna do because otherwise I would just blitz right cool. through this first one if I was the runner first yeah I'll probably be fail flailing about pushing buttons and pulling levers yeah. and not knowing what's going on so um, Ooh, first, equipment. if you want to set your spawn in that bed, that's pretty vital. Wait a second. Okay. Yeah, I probably should do that. That may even stop the rain if, I we, just... if we set it today. Hmm? Yep. It turned off. So can I take whatever I want out of this chest, or...? Yeah. Am Feel I free. only allowed one row of it, or you can do whatever you want? The rules are, um, are you they... can do whatever you want as long as you don't, as long as you enter the, and exit the tunnels from your section, and don't try to come up here, that kind of thing. But yeah, you can take whatever you want from that okay. box. That's for you. But it's it's sort of arranged in rows on purpose. I mean, is this sign encha enchanted? No, it's just I needed a, I needed something else to put there, and I thought, why not a sign? Okay. I'm definitely going to take a pick. I have uh, I spent a lot of time balance testing, especially the second area. And um, that that uh, sword has very specific enchants on it to balance the dan the uh, the combat with the monsters. I guess I'll take some spare man pants and a man helmet. Mhm. Mm because I'll probably want to just toss out my armor and put on fresh armor. Yeah, well, every time... all this food. Yeah. Well, every time you die, you could just, like, get another a new strip of equipment. Uh-huh. So I'm I just put... not planning on dying. Oh, you're going to die. I put enough in there for uh, <laughs> at least 10 deaths for each chamber. Uh, is there, like, a any way to begin this, or do I just basically walk in there? Go ahead. Yeah, I could have already been um, starting the mechanism, but uh, I want you to see what happens. Okay. I will see what happens. Yeah, I, I think it's rather good. Alright, so I just what tunnel? I guess I tunnel in here. Mm -hmm. You see this nice bright room in front of you? Yeah, that looks totally harmless. And then there's zombies everywhere. <laughs> yep, I have a uh, obsidian, or uh, not obsidian, uh, cobblestone generators in the ground that raise raise walls with pistons that separate the uh, glowstone from the area you're in, so it creates areas of darkness. And anytime you tunnel through a wall, I can I can fix the wall. Oh, cool. And you're just going to be up there shooting at me. Yep. <laughs> of course. And I have to sit here and fight these stupid uh, multiplayer zombies mm -hmm. that lag all over the place. Did you put blue wool in the gap? Is that what that is? Yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you said I could take everything. Yeah, yeah. No, you can. You definitely can. I, I just hadn't thought of that. I wanted some blocks to stand on. I guess so. I may have to consider that for the next area. <clears throat> well, honestly, like... I've got plenty of uh, I've got plenty of staircases already. Yeah. From digging the thing out, <clears throat> so it's not really, it's not really a huge deal. Okay, so I have to wait for my health to resurrect because you're over there just shooting at me. Yeah, getting past the zombies at this part is. Is a little slow because of that. Well, it kind of sucks that uh, I, I hate fighting zombies in multiplayer. Yeah, yeah, the, the, the laggy they multiplayer hit code is terrible. I, I actually you the um, entire entire map of this. I will be complaining about SMP. I promise you. <laughs> the um, I've tested this quite a bit, and to try, I've done a lot of things to change it to try to reduce lag. 
I even I downloaded a plugin that lets you remove monsters and items off the ground, so that uh, the game stops worrying about parts of the map you're no longer in. Oh, oh, nice one! He almost knocked me off. That would have granted you some time. So wait, are we? Uh, does time matter? Time doesn't matter. No, I guess not. It's just death, so I basically, you're rewarded for playing carefully. And where are you zombies keep coming from? There's spawners in the ground. Yeah, I know that, but it doesn't look dark enough for them to spawn here. Oh, it's definitely dark enough. Well, there, I'll put a torch out. Stupid zombie pigman. <laughs> You're playing quite Just give defensively. Me an to shoot at you. <laughs> well, I, I'm going into unknown territory, so on that's, my still on caves map, I ran, I ran through it like a reckless madman because yeah, I true. knew the layout. <laughs> but on this, I have no idea what you've done out here. And it's not like I can sit and study the place because you're up there shooting at me. Yeah. And we're never gonna hit each other from right here. Can I even so. shoot through that gap? I don't think I can shoot nope, through that stair. No, but you can stare. give me more arrows. Thanks for the arrows, buddy. You're welcome. I, I gave you 12 stacks already, so I wasn't really <laughs> that worried about it. I think I've, I've already used 30 arrows. Wow. All right, I need explosive arrows. I just... Where do you... What what version of this is this on a one point one server? Yes, <laughs> just kill the zombies. The zombies and keep getting in here. Light up the room because they're gonna keep the spawners are along I the walls. I want to shoot you though. <laughs> yeah, I want to shoot you though. Okay. I have to. I did not anticipate I mean, you're someone me the just. Of... Hmm. You, you you're giving me the choice of uh, shooting at you, or. Uh, Killing zombies, and I'd much rather just shoot at you. <laughs> I've play tested this with a few people, and you're the first person to ever just hang out there and, and shoot back. I want to shoot at you. I, I understand. I understand. So I'm gonna go this way. Okay. Oh, you're just tunneling through the ground. <laughs> Is this the first? Uh... So I'm not the first person that you've... No, I've playtested it with the guys that I record Life on Bagoda with. Uh-huh. And no one else has bothered to just tunnel through the ground. Everyone else just ran in and lit stuff up. Okay. I may have to do something about that. No, oh, this is annoying when people tunnel through your maps. Yeah, it is. <laughs> And they just bypass all, all the cool stuff you made? Yeah. Oh, I yeah. see an arrow there. Thank you. You're welcome. It's like I, I don't I don't I don't want to see I mean I see that there's like there's like pathways and walkways and there's glowstone, it's hanging from the ceiling, it looks cool. I don't want to see any of that. I wanna just dig in the ground here and make a tunnel. <laughs> well it looks like I'll be um I'll be adding some bedrock to my uh to the map <laughs> for the official release. <laughs> I appreciate the irony here. Yeah. Okay. Let's see here. I can tell you based on testing it that a moving target, a moving player is hard to hit at this distance in multiplayer. And if you just run in, yep. if you kill the zombies and just run in and light up the walls, it will be pretty hard for me to stop you. Zip. That's a lot of zombies. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Once you get past this area, it gets faster. Oh, well, I don't know. Knowing, seeing how you've played so far, it may not get faster. Well, you have to remember, I'm a. I mean, I, I'm coming from Race from Wool, where it's just like trench warfare, dig around, don't yeah. let the enemy shoot at you. Yeah. Build a TNT cannon and then take them out. Yeah, I tried to design this map so it would be played fairly quickly. So I may have to do something about the tunneling. 
<laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Whoops. Well, this is this I is good. I wanted a, like one last beta test before I released the full version, because I, I I was sure stuff like this would come up that I would have to fix. Yeah. So they should be. I don't think any more is going to spawn. There's still a few hanging out there, but. Hey! -o. Ow! Did I hit you? Yep, right in the face. Pow! Right in the kisser. Yep. Where are you, zombie pigman? <laughs> I'm right above you. <laughs> you know, if you actually kill me, it doesn't count, right? <laughs> for the actual it any less fun. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh god. Oh god. It's oh, a lot god. easier to shoot down than it is to shoot up. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Ow. Stupid pig man. Go away. <laughs> I'll shoot you and knock you off there. Here. I hit you twice. You can't have much life left. Oh, I guess you're wearing iron armor, huh? Yep. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Your stuff is mine. <laughs> well, it's... All you're getting is two more pieces of armor for the mm, most part. Diamond pickaxe. Oh, that's yes. true. Shit. <laughs> you just gave me a diamond pickaxe. I and did. I've got pieces of armor that I... Did not have used to have access to. So now I've got a full set of iron armor. That's Thank true. Thank you, Mr. Pigman. You were generous. You're welcome. Damn it. All right, so I'm taking that armor out of these chests for the controller. <laughs> wow, well done. <laughs> Damn, it's full iron armor. All right. <laughs> Consider... So I just booked through there as soon as you died. Yeah, you're the first person to not get destroyed by the creepers. 